There will be rumbles across Liverpool this weekend as defending champions, Manchester City storm Amfield for one of the Week 28 matches of the English Premier League. It is a clash of the table toppers and a match that will most likely define the season for both clubs. Welcome to Rainbow Sports, my name is Ibrahim Mohamed. This clash of the titans will go a long way to determine whether Liverpool will win their 20th EPL title or whether Manchester City will successfully defend their title. A draw could also favour Arsenal, who are also gunning for the league title. The rivalry between Jurgen Klopp and Pep Guardiola dates back to their days in the German Bundesliga, where Klopp was in charge of Borussia Dortmund while Guardiola was the gaffer of Bayern Munich. In the English Premier League, both managers have met 15 times with Pep recording 5 wins and 6 draws while Klopp has only 4 wins. Guardiola City have scored 30 goals while Klopp's Liverpool have scored 21 goals. This will be their last English Premier League encounter as Jurgen Klopp will be leaving Liverpool at the end of the season. Their last meeting was the reverse of this fixture on November 25, 2023 at the Etihad Stadium. The fiercely contested encounter ended 1-1. The citizens opened scoring in the 27th minute when defender Nathan Ake dribbled his way through the Liverpool defence to set up Erling Haaland to score his 50th English Premier League goal. It remained a ding-dong affair until 10 minutes to full time when Mohamed Salah placed a through pass to Trent Alexander-Arnold who slotted home the equaliser to silence the noisy Manchester City fans. Last season, both sides won at home and lost away. At Anfield on December 22, 2022, Alison Baker set up Mohamed Salah for the only goal of the match. On April 1, 2023, the citizens came from behind to whitewash Liverpool 4-1 at the Etihad in their way to winning a record equaling treble. Mohamed Salah had put the visitors ahead in the 17th minute. Ten minutes later, Julian Alvarez restored parity. Just after the break Kevin De Bruyne fired Manchester into the lead. Ike Gondogan doubled City's lead seven minutes from the hour mark, before Jack Grealish added the icing on the cake in the 74th minute to give Manchester City a resounding victory. That victory was City's 100th Premier League home win under Pep Guardiola, in their 128th match at the Etihad Stadium. It is the fastest a manager has reached 100 home wins in the competition, beating Arsene Wenger's previous record of 139 games. It was also the first time Liverpool lost a Premier League match after scoring first since February 2021, when they lost 1-3 to Leicester City. Both sides also met in the round of 16 of last season's EFL Cup and City defeated Liverpool 3-2. You already know that Liverpool have won this season's EFL Cup with a lone goal victory over Chelsea, and they are still chasing the Premier League, the Europa League and the FA Cup. What do you think, can Liverpool win a quadruple this season? In other fixtures this weekend, Manchester United will hope to bounce back to winning ways after their loss to City rivals last weekend when they host Everton at Old Trafford. Crystal Palace will lurk horns with Luton Town as Bournemouth tread tackles with Sheffield United. Wolverhampton Wanderers will attempt to devour Fulham as Arsenal attempt to gun down Brentford. Aston Villa will welcome Tottenham Hotspurs to the Villa Park as West Ham take on Burnley. Brighton and Nottingham Forest will fight to finish at the Amex Stadium as Chelsea attempt to disunite Newcastle United at the Stamford Bridge. That was our show.